we've got a wonderful announcement here today, and we're kind of getting used to these, which I like. For the reason we're here today, and, and I want to introduce John to you guys, John Kirby, who's a wonderful guy, got to know him. Uh, he's a big supporter of Charleston, has family here. And, uh, but I, I'll tell you, John, I haven't been able to get into the holiday spirit um, <laughs> this year. I, I just haven't been able to do it. I, I've had a little surgery. I've been down. I just, I just, even though Spencer's made this place look so beautiful and the beautiful trees we have out front, I just haven't been able to get that, that holiday Christmas spirit going. And, and so with further ado, I want to tell you the present John gave me. Caroline, if y'all would. Thank you, John, for giving me the Christmas spirit with three, three nonstop flights daily to wonderful cities like Fort Lauderdale, Philadelphia, and Newark. John, thank you so much uh, for believing in Charleston, and we look forward to continuing and growing this relationship going forward. And we look to see a big presence from Mary Long here in the upcoming years. Now, Elliot already let the cat out of the bag, but what I will, I will say is that um, uh, service begins April 5th, so right in time for Easter. Um, and if those services do well, we can add more. I look around this airport, and this really exemplifies what's happening in Charleston. This is a beautiful airport, and just every year I come here, it's nicer and nicer. So again, kudos to the airport team and the community. Uh, for developing this. I'd also like to thank Elliot and his team have been wonderful. Spencer, Chris, and all the team in getting us ready. This is not an easy exercise. And often air service development is a marathon, not a sprint. We want to make sure that you enjoy your experience and come back to Spirit Airlines. Two, three. Charleston has Spirit!